Hi friends, Right Careers welcomes you to another brand new video for this week. This is Yes Sudarshan, your career coach. Right, this week we have taken a very interesting topic, I should say, a topic that is that will be very, very exciting for youngsters because it deals with what we all like. We all like bikes, we all like cars, we all like vehicles, right? So this week we thought we will choose a topic that is going to talk about automobile. Yes, the topic for this week is automobile engineering as a career option. So that's the topic for this week. So let us straight away get on to the topic. So what is automobile engineering or rather what does automobile engineers do? So first of all, this is a sub branch of mechanical engineering, I should say, because this is broadly come under mechanical engineering, right? So what typically what an automobile engineer does is uh, they usually design, they usually uh, repair, they usually maintain and operate automobiles. Now automobile could be small, big, anything. It could be as small as a two wheeler or it could be as big as a, as a truck or even, you know, a tractor or, or a JCB kind of automobile. So automobile could be anything. So basically automobile engineers prepare a blueprint for automobiles. They also oversee the entire process right from conceptualizing to designing to producing and then market entry. So till the time from the time of conceptualization till the time it reaches the market, automobile engineers are responsible for everything right from prototyping to going to the market. So with the advent of e-mobility, with the advent of e-vehicles, automobile engineers are going to be in great demand for the future. Now, usually automobile engineers work in three categories. The first category is definitely in the area of design and then in the category of research and development and then finally in the production category. We will see all these things in detail. So now moving on, what are the professional career opportunities that exist in automobile engineering space? The first career option definitely is in the form of automobile engineer itself. So what an automobile engineer does, we just saw manufacture and operate automobile. Now this, this not only includes production, this also includes you know the mechanical part, the electrical part, the, the software part and then eventually the safety part. Now if you look at some of the cars that comes in these days today, it is loaded with technology, right? It is some cars have a caption internet inside. I'm talking about Morris Garage. So you know, these cars are filled with technology. I mean, it makes the driving even more exciting, right? So that's exactly what automobile engineers do. So automobile engineers are not only into production. They got to be in mechanical side of the, you know, uh, design. They got to be in the designing side. They got to be in the mechanical side. They got to be in the, in the software side. And they also need to be in the safety aspect of producing any form of automobile. So this is exactly what a automobile engineer does. And that's the first profession. The second professional career opportunity that I can think of is in the form of automobile designing or rather automobile designer. They usually work with automobile engineers. They design the appearance of the car. If you take a car, you know, it's a small car or hatchback or, or sedan or SUV. We, we have numerous forms, right? So it is the automobile designers who design this format of the car and they usually design their components and also the parts for the respective you know whatever automobile machine that they manufacture so, so that's the second uh, career opportunity that we can think of the third career opportunity that we can think of is in the form of research and development now it's very essential that uh, automobile engineers work with r d people because research and development form the innovative part or rather what the uh, i mean the, the most important part i should say we all like ambi right now nobody hates ambi it's, it's an iconic car but would you all like to go back to ambassador today no because there are numerous other cars that have come up stylish cars you know quite compact in nature that that runs into today's roads and, and parking made easy if you if you look at recent Volkswagen's polo advertisement it talks about how parking is made very, very easy, you know, smart parking and things like that. So it is the research and development team that understands what your client, what, your, what the customer wants, what we all want as, as public and then comes up with solution. So that's the third professional career opportunity. So research and development, they bring out innovative ideas and develop new prototypes based on market requirements. The fourth professional career opportunity that I can think of is definitely in the form of quality control. 
Now, quality plays a very important role in automobile engineering. It only works on the efficiency of existing automobiles and also while producing new automobile, it helps in developing and formulating the quality part. So, these are some of the professional career opportunities that we can think of in automobile engineering. Now, how do a student or how do one become an automobile engineer? What are the etiquettes? The first thing is after 10th standard, someone should have chosen physics, chemistry and mathematics, which means PCM or PCB also at times is acceptable. So in 12th standard, basically you have to take science group and then you have to study B.Tech in automobile engineering. Many colleges has this program. We'll talk about which colleges, but you can always study mechanical engineering and then specialize in automobile at your postgraduate level, which is fine. You can also pursue B.Tech in automobile engineering and then you can for, for just for academic interest, there are M.Tech programs in automobile engineering, in manufacturing technology. So there are quite a lot of uh, post graduation options available for the academic interest. Which institutes you to study? Definitely in India, I can think of definitely in the form of IIT. IIT Delhi has this program, IIT Roorkee has this program and numerous amount of uh, government public universities and private universities will have for example in Tamil Nadu you have Anna University has this program uh, you take the uh, University of uh, Bangalore I'm sure they'll have and then if you come down to private all leading private universities like Amrita, VIT, SRM, Hindustan, you know Manav, Rachna you name it they will have right so these are some of the institutes you can google in your respective cities to identify which colleges offer automobile engineering now, which companies will recruit automobile engineering students? Definitely all the core companies will visit some good leading campuses. Uh, some of the core companies that I can think of which usually visits and takes care of all the employees properly are Maruti Suzuki. Definitely there's no doubt it's a leader in automobile sector. And then you have Mahindra and Mahindra. You have Asia Motors and then you have Tata Motors. You have Escorts, uh, Hyundai, etc. These are some of the homegrown companies. Some of the international companies do come and recruit as well like like Ford or, or Audi, BMW, you know, Jeep and quite a lot of companies do come and recruit from various campuses. Now, at this point in time, I'd also like to clear one myth that surrounds this particular space in the form of automobile engineering. Now, what is that myth? We all know that the world is moving towards E, right? Electronic vehicle, E vehicle. I'm sure you'd have seen a lot of E vehicles in the roads these days, not only in scooter, even in bikes. Not only in bikes, you see cars also becoming electric. For example, Hyundai has Kona, which is a five-seater SUV ex exclusively made for uh, uh, electric purposes. Now, with the advent of electric purposes, some of the people, now I'm not saying everybody, some feel that the role of automobile engineers has shrinked down. Now, if you ask me, the answer is a big no. I'll tell you why. Respective of the engine, it can be electric or it can be petrol or diesel, who will design the vehicles? It's the automobile engineers who still have to go and design the vehicle. One. Number two, even if the engine is replaced, you know, only engine changes. Everything will remain the same, right? The body remains the same. The prototype remains the same. The brake, the clutch, you know, everything, the accelerator, everything, all other parts and components remain the same. You might still ask me a question. All, most of the cars are becoming automatic. So there is no need for a clutch or uh, there's no need for gearboxes. And some people might ask me this question. Even if you don't need a gear, all other parts are required. You have to have a brake in a car, right? So who designs that? It's, it's the role of automobile engineers. Uh, the strength of the vehicle, the car weight, the suspension, shock absorbers. Now all the parts are something like that has to be designed by automobile engineer. The only biggest difference between electric and non-electric will be the propulsion system. Now all other things will remain the same. So straight away, myth is cleared. Even if electric vehicles is going to dominate the roads, automobile engineers will have to play a major role as always in our video the pros and cons the pros if you ask me it's very very stable career automobile industry is an industry that has to grow we are seeing the advent of vehicles so this career will be really stable uh yeah it's well paid also well paid out career some of the automobile engineers get really really paid well that's the second advantage i can think of the third advantage is uh, you can definitely transform yourself to an entrepreneur very easily because this is one profession when you know the subject matter expertise you can become an entrepreneur, you can set up a service center, you can set up a body shop, you can set up a, your own you know, sales uh, outlet and things like that. So you can become an entrepreneur easily. So these are some of the advantages that I can think of. Some of the flip side, definitely it's a stressful profession, long working hours, especially when you have to introduce or when the launch date of a vehicle is announced, so you've got to work backwards and then that time, those time will be really, really stressful in nature. 
and you also constantly need to you know innovate yourself what sells today will not sell tomorrow what sold yesterday will not sell today right i mean nobody buys premier padmini today even if they come out in market very few will be takers you know so that therefore i mean some of the iconic cars we have seen like you know toyota qualis which was a top selling car toyota stopped it and then you know did something else in the form of innova and it became an overnight success so you got to innovate as a automobile engineer now another flip side that i can think of is uh, mostly automobile engineers work in workshops mostly they don't work in you know fancy it places or some other professions uh, where there are fancy office spaces or corporate office spaces they usually work in workshops so these are the three you know uh, a few flip side that i can think of now overall if you ask me automobile engineering if you are if you are really really passionate about you know machines if you are passionate about vehicles you know transform the country in 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 this this space automobile engineering is definitely a good career to think of hope you all enjoyed watching this video and uh, you know in case you have any doubts on automobile engineering or any other career related questions feel free to ping us whatsapp us or call us the contact numbers are very much there in this video until next monday uh, with a brand new video thank you so much for watching this and have a great week thanks a lot mm -hmm.